hi everyone this is my iMac 21 inch uh, slimline iMac the model number is A1418 um, in this video I'm gonna show you if you have encountered a problem like this the folder icon with the question mark which means there's no OS installed in this iMac uh, this is by the way the late 2013 iMac um, in this video I'm gonna show you how to install the Mac OS and get this machine back into life so without wasting any more time I'm gonna go ahead and uh, show you how to fix this error first of all I'm gonna turn off this Mac and then I'll take it from there I'm gonna turn off this Mac by keep uh, pressing to the power button Mac is turned off what you're gonna do is as soon as you turn on the Mac you need to press and hold command and R key on the keyboard if it's a Apple keyboard if it's a Windows keyboard like mine Windows mark and the R key press and hold it until it until you see the uh, recovery mode internet recovery mode Keep pressing those key, command and R key, and that will go straight to the internet recovery mode. And what will happen is um, iMac has a, a image recovery system within the machine. So once you press command and R key, that will take you to the internet recovery mode. So in here you can select the network which is I'm gonna select my Wi-Fi network and enter my password which is Wi-Fi password. Now what happened is um, iMac connecting to the internet. As you can see it's connected to the internet and now it's searching the recovery options. As you can see, uh, that process is done. Now we should boot to the OS recovery mode. Let's wait and see. Here you go. Let me take this a bit closer so you can have a better look. Let me As you can see this is the OX10 utilities which means the recovery mode you can what I do normally I go to disk utility first there you can see the hard drive this is the Apple hard drive one terabyte internal hard drive in there what I would do is select the hard drive what I'm gonna do is I'm gonna erase the hard disk I always choose macOS extended journal you can name whatever the name you want to put I'm gonna I'm gonna put macOS and I'm gonna press erase and erase again it will start erasing process now the erase process is done I'm going to close this window in here you can select reinstall OS 10 or if you have a backup from your previous iMac or MacBook you can reinstall your Mac OS with your all your data by restoring from Time Machine backup. So if you 
don't know how to restore your Mac using Time Machine. I have done another video about uh, about Time Machine backup. You can click on the link above appearing now. You will learn lots of things how to backup by using Restore Time Machine Backup. I'm going to select Reinstall OX 10 and press continue. Basically, you'll have to follow the instructions coming up. So, I'm going to say agree. If you have time to read the agreement, read it before press the agreed button. I don't have time to read the agreement. I'm going to press agreed. And this is the hard drive we just formatted or erased. I'm going to select that hard drive. Remember, I have renamed it Mac OS. I'm going to select that hard drive and press install. This process is going to take time. Definitely the time depends on the internet connection you have. In my case it takes about 55-54 minutes to download the Mac OS. Once it's completed, iMac automatically will restart. Let's wait for that process. There you go. Download the OS process is done. Uh, now what happened is um, the installation process. So iMac automatically restarted. I should say restarting. So let's wait and see what will happen next. Here we have latest downloaded Mac OS installed to the iMac. Now, uh, in fact, it's not installed yet. It's going to be installed to this iMac. So uh, this this process take another half an hour or so so we'll I will come back once it installed so once the installation process done uh, we are all good to go so we'll wait and see the process once again I'm gonna pass forward as I said earlier now is the time to install the Mac OS it's installing itself once it downloaded so this will take another 17 minutes once this process is done uh, this iMac is ready to use so guys this is the way you can fix if you get that fold icon with question mark uh, which means there's no OS installed in the iMac this is the I find it this is the easiest way to fix that issue so thank you for watching this video until I see you with another video I will see you soon.